So Project Camelot, gee, they talk about some interesting things, but you know, they interview some really fucked up people. We have an artificial sun in the sky now since um, uh, 2003, 2005, I'm not sure when. You annoying fat turd. Emily Windsor Craig. Now she claims to be the legitimate heir of the royal throne. Claims that she's going to put Queen Elizabeth II on trial. Claims to be the daughter of Edward VIII. Of course! She claims to be a contactee who has telepathic communication with the Anunnaki. She believes that the fish in the oceans and the lakes around the world are going to die out. But hey, it's okay because the powers that be are just going to replace them. She knows all about Nabooru. Oh yeah. You didn't hear it here. She knows all about Nabooru, the plans coming up, the prophecy, the predictions about Yahweh, God, and all that stuff going on. And it's not testable. <laughs> but it doesn't need to be because she's got telepathic communication with the Anunnaki. Who needs it? And from that time, we've been wrapped by called Planet X, which is a toroid of dark matter. So yeah, she can say anything she wants about Nibiru, Planet X, or Nemesis, because hey, I'm getting it from the Anunnaki inside my head. Ladies and gentlemen, is that good enough for you? Uh, yeah. Oh, my, my invisible friend is telling me something. Okay, yeah. Oh, oh right, um, the reason why your test didn't work is because they changed it. Um, a set of vibrating matter at a certain location and the fifth and the seventh and the ninth densities cling to us where there are other other surfaces where other beings who operate at different vibratory rates can incarnate and exist have been subjected to a kind of word salad of scientific jargon used out of context with in inappropriately, apparently uncomprehendingly. Ah! Ah! You fucking shit! Cut! 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 Ah! Cut! Motherfucker! Turns out that everything I fucking thought about you was wrong. 